Danny Coyle and his 11-year-old dog Lulu are reunited following a frightening 12 hours. Coyle says on Monday afternoon he made a brief stop at his workplace just around the corner from his Scarborough home when all of a sudden... As soon as I came back out within 30 seconds, not even a minute I don't think, and all of a sudden I looked out and I said, oh my God, someone took my car. The white Kia SUV was gone with Lulu in the front seat. Coyle quickly became distressed over his dog's safety. What was going through your mind? Uh, panicking, because I, I didn't care about my car. It was just her I was worried about. After a desperate hours-long search around his area with no sign of Lulu, an extremely concerned Coyle went to bed. But not too long after his head hit the pillow, he was woken up with a call from police. So we got... Uh, Good news says we got your car and we got Lulu. Durham police tracked the stolen vehicle to Oshawa and successfully placed the driver into custody. Officers told Coyle a high speed chase was involved with the suspect reaching speeds of up to 180 kilometers an hour. At last, the two were reunited early Tuesday morning with Lulu doing just as well as when Coyle last saw her. It was fantastic. She came up with the big kisses and all that kind of stuff. And he says, can we take photos of her now? So he put her in the seat and take a photo after photo. Along with Lulu, Coyle's car is now back in his driveway following that hours long joyride, which included a trip to McDonald's, a handful of cigarettes, not to mention the front and back end damage. 28 year old Patrick Burke of Toronto is facing numerous charges, including possession of a property obtained by crime over and driving while under suspension. As for Coyle, while he's one of the lucky ones to get his car back, he says he's even luckier to have his furry companion back in his arms. She's just that little special kind of little person. And I, I call her a little person. <laughs> She's a great little girl. Brittany Rosen, Global News.